Hey, it's probably for 132, and I actually am reshooting the beginning of my this video right here. This is an organization video for your makeup, and I got this product. I believe it's Staples. Yeah, it is like Staples. Nothing like special like home goods or anything like that. Um, but yeah, and I've seen these videos a lot, and I see how people love to like show their organization tips for how they do their makeup. So this is mine, and I think I just said I resh I'm reshooting this, so if you kind of like see me, like I'm wearing like a gray shirt, that's because that was before this whole thing. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and there we go. Ah, isn't it beautiful? I'm going to move back a little bit, and hello, I'm going to move back so you don't see me. Okay, so this is the product I use, and I hope you can tell, like, spins around. So, yeah. So, I'm going to show you how I organize my makeup in this. So, on top of something that doesn't fit really into these little pots, oh, sorry, is my natural, to face natural face palette, and I love this for the brightener. That's really pretty much the thing that I use with this product. But it does have some good products. And I kind of want to try using the bronzer. And the cream blushes are like so, oh my god, pigmented. It's like, I have, I'll do a swatch. And I find it really kind of dark, but it works. Okay. So in here, I don't know, there's like a little roll up top in here. So in here I keep some stuff that don't really have a place. So first thing I have is my Intense Brow Pencil by Benefit. God, this is like a brow lifesaver. This is in the color light because I have blonde hair, if you haven't noticed. Um, the end that has a spool in the back. And then all I do is comb and I color. And then I don't really gel them. I feel like they're just fine, but I think I'm going to start gelling them. Okay, then I have my MAC Cream Color Base. And I love this product. And this just does, you could use this for so many things. But um, And this is in the color Hush. It's just like a pinkish salmon-y color. And that has so many things you can use it for. So it's just in there. And these are the things that don't really have a spot. And this has another eyebrow color that I have. It's like the darkest, but it's like the dark brown without like, without the, sh the one without the shimmer. This one right here, the one I'm touching. Hello, see? It's like reflecting. Ooh. Um, yeah, I hope I'm not blinding you. But yeah, that's, ugh, oops. That's what I use. And I used to use this for my brows. I kind of stopped. But I did used to keep it in here when I first got this. So, yeah. So, now I still keep it in there and I can still use it for my shadow. So, this thing right here. This holds random emergent. Oh, I'm going to take this off, actually. Um, I have products that I do really need. Um, I'll move out of the screen. That I do really need. And, like, first... This is a stippling brush, and the reason I keep it in here is just because this isn't a brush that I use every day, and this was in the thing that I used to keep all this makeup in, if you remember, it's like this makeup brush I had. And it keeps it in there, and then I'm just like, ugh, I didn't fit to all my everyday brushes, and since I do use this mostly every day, I just keep it in here just because this one's the one with the most room. And then I keep my, like, two full-size eyeliners, my Sephora black one, and my Bare Minerals brown one. And I keep my Sephora little grapefruit one, but I love, love, love. And and purple liners are great for green eyes. So if you have green eyes, use a purple liner. They're amazing. And then our Bardiki Prime Potion because this is a Holy Grail primer. And I kind of want to try the Too Faced one, but I don't want to spend the money on it because that one I still have a lot left of. So, yeah. So then here I have Sephora lipstick in the color Crazy Coral, and I love this. And you're probably thinking, wow, that's... That's, that's orange. It's not orange. It's pink. It gives you a hot, pink, like, nice, nude color. Uh, orange. Maybe it has an orange undertone, but it's really, really pink if you're a stick. Ooh, said it right. I usually chopstick. And as you can tell, I'm almost out. Just because I really like this. Um, It's pretty good. I love my EOS Lip Balm more, but it doesn't really fit into here, so I keep it in my set for base and then in my NYC bronzer that I use every day and plus this doesn't have all my face stuff pretty much the, my most important face and like eye products are just sitting on the counter like that I use with like so yeah so if you want me to show you those just leave a comment down below and, like if you want me to show you what I use every day every day 
or do like an everyday makeup tutorial, I'll do that. And I actually really love this bronzer. It's it's, it's really good for the price, and I, I don't use any other bronzer besides this one. So next year, I keep mascaras and lip products. And they fit really nicely into here. So first thing I have is a MAC Sheen Supreme Lip Glass in Cherry Fest. And these are the new ones. These are like the ones that Stella has. Like, if you know what I'm talking about, with like those, and you have to like roll it up. So the lip gloss comes out, and I really like this. It just gives you a nice glowy glossy color. I have Buxom Lip Glass lip cream in creamsicle and I actually do really love this. They're really pigmented. I think I just here's a swatch of it. I don't know if you could see it. It's right there. Really pretty pigmented. So I love that. And these fit perfectly into there. I have another MAC and this is a Pro Long Wear and this is in Patience Please. And then let me just see if you can see that. It's the top one. A new then my favorite mascara of all time, which is the MAC Hot and Naughty, which I love about this is you have this wand, which is just like to like make your lashes the length, and it, and this volumizes and like separates them, which is amazing. So you have two in one mascara, which is really cool. So you don't have to buy two different mascaras. And then I have a waterproof one just in case the day my eyes feel watery. But sometimes they do, but you know. There we go, perfect. Next, I keep Buxom Blush Breathless. I'm not going to get into that. And then I have a MAC highlighter that I don't really use. It's in Miss Beware. And I just bought this because I do love it. I really do. I feel like it's just not something I'm using at the moment. So, that's just there. And here I have face products. I'm not really going to get into I have the Amazing Cosmetics Concealer, my NARS Concealer, my Fresh Twilight Highlighter, my Fresh Twilight Primer, the Liquid Travel Little Ones. Then in here I have... Random eye products. I have Glamour to go. And I'm pretty sure everyone has seen this. It's really... Ooh, just put my hand in the lip gloss. Ugh, whatever. And then it comes with a blush that sucks. Don't use the blush. At least mine sucks. Um, I'm in a Fusion Trio. And I actually love this company, Mineral Fusion. I, I don't really hear a lot of people talk about it on YouTube. So, I'm just going to put it out there. It's amazing. It's an organic company. Mine's at my local Whole Foods. But it's actually really expensive. Oh my god. My nose I shut up broke. That's why it always shakes. <laughs> oh, I have to hot glue that back. And this is an apps and it's my favorite all over lip color. So I pretty much use every single time I do I on my do my eyes. Like put on eyeshadow. Okay, um, so I love that, and I'm so upset right now, but you know what, whatever, I'm okay. Alright, it's like, I'll get over it. It's just a nice shadow, no big deal. So now we hit the bottom. Here I keep two gel liners, um, Maybelline and MAC, my Ruminex paint pots, and my Cocker Spaniel cream eyeshadow. And I'm not going to get into these, they're like nothing special. Here I have my other lip, lip products like lipsticks and a chat and a lip balm that I use like as a lip is a lipstick as a lip is a ugh, my lip balm is used as a chapstick like for, for when my lips are chapped. My Nicki Minaj lipstick by Mac, amazing. My Mineral Fusion lipstick and Exotic. I'm not gonna get into these because it's like already nine minutes and it's really long. My two little mini bite lipsticks. My Born to Be Lippy by. And this is amazing when your lips are chapped. Like, seriously, you have to get this. I mean, this thing for my naked palette that I just is so small that it fit perfectly. And then my other Sephora lipstick in, in Paradise Purple. And it's not purple. It actually turns into a really, really light pink. With a purple undertone. I don't know if you can see it. It's like, And I only did like th five times of it. So, yeah. But I do love it lot. I mean, it works great. Sorry, these things are annoying to put back. That's the only thing I have annoying with this because it's so annoying to put them back. But everything fits perfectly in here. Okay. Next, I have my four MAC eyeshadow. I have Shroom, Rice, and Shroom, Orb, All That Glitters, and Yogurt. And that is it. Okay. I have to do this really fast, but all I want to say is bye. I hope you enjoyed the video. That's not my whole makeup collection, and I want to give a shout-out to my friends. 
know who you are, and that is it. Okay, bye.